Rise Royals. All right. Welcome. I am Goddess Platinum and you have made it to the home of the Twin Flames. All right. So this reading is going to be a little different. <laughs> As I probably said in a few of my recent videos, okay, because Spirit has been trying to guide and lead me into some different things on this channel. So I hope you guys are open-minded and ready to receive. Okay, I've been feeling like some of you guys have not been getting good sleep or haven't been sleeping at all. Okay, and I feel like a lot of the reasons why is because of your twin flame. You know, some of you are lying awake in bed at night and you know just really reminiscing and um missing your person so it keeps you up at night so you know i felt like i could come in here and maybe kind of help you fall asleep okay so my voice will be very very low in this video okay so if this is something that um you want to stick around for definitely do that okay i'm gonna hop straight into it though okay let's see who it is that we're going to be connecting with all right i am going to try to soothe you guys with my voice and with a little bit of shuffling here <laughs> okay so let's get into it so we could be connecting with an Aquarius. Okay, Aquarius is out here. Very strong. This can be <clears throat> your person's sun, moon, or rising. Or it can be your sun, moon, or rising. Okay, we got Capricorn out here. Aquarius is out here three times, you guys. <laughs> Oops. And then we have Sagittarius. We have Aries, Scorpio, and Gemini. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, Spirit, take me into this connection. Why is some of my royals not able to sleep at night why is there a bit of insomnia here okay <laughs> oh okay okay so yeah this is this is trying to get into a little bit of 18 plus okay with the king of wands out here okay and so what that's giving me you guys is that you're lying in bed at night thinking dreaming lusting over your person okay and you know i feel like it's very very strong okay i just saw the lover's card <laughs> this is a very strong connection okay very passionate connection here that you have with your person um mm -hmm. and see you're coming out as the queen of pentacles so you know some of you may even work very uh late hours so what i'm getting is from these two cards is that you are working late divine feminine and it doesn't have to be um you know that you're actually going out to a job, okay? Because some of you work at home or work from home, okay? So I'm picking up an energy that is working very, very late into the hours, okay? Late into um, the night, okay? And either you're coming home or you're at home and you're very fatigued, right? You're very tired, you um sometimes you don't know whether you're coming or going okay that's not good okay um 
love. You know, I just see a divine feminine working very, very hard here. You know, uh, some of you are single parents, okay? And I can definitely uh, resonate with being a single parent. I know what that's like. I know what it's like to, um, you know, have to work your ass off, you know, just to provide for your family, okay? Maybe you met a Divine Masculine here that brought a sense of stability to your world, right? Brought the fire, right? Brought the passion, okay? So I do see someone just kind of tuck and work away, right? And climbing into the bed, scrolling through their phone and not being very tired, right? Even though you have been working all these hours, I see someone that, you know, is still like not tired, right? You may be on your phone kind of going through pictures of you and your divine masculine, Right, and I see someone here that is, you know, just kind of tucked under the covers. You know what I'm saying? It's cold, right? You have maybe a pillow in between your legs just because, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm getting the hot and bothered energy. <laughs> you know, when you're thinking about your person, you know, it's just kind of like I see someone tucking a pillow in between their legs really wishing that it was their person, right? Instead of the pillow. Okay. Mm, that's what I'm picking up. And you just going through your phone and looking at how fine your divine masculine is and, and really just thinking, how the hell am I going to get over this person, right? How? Mm, okay give me some more energy spirit so we got the knight of cups out here right right you know it's just kind of like uh you wanting this person to come in rescue you you know also pick up a divine feminine that just kind of lays there in bed wishing that they would hear that knock at the door you know um hear that doorbell ring right just kind of watching the clock you know kind of going all right it's eight o'clock <laughs> you know what i'm saying maybe um, they'll stop by in the next hour you know what i'm saying um when they get off work or you know um okay it's 11 o'clock now they gotta be off work by now like i just see somebody just kind of going time is going by why hasn't my person come and knocked on my door or rang my doorbell okay so this may be another reason why you can't sleep divine feminine okay because you're so worried about you're masculine. Thank you, spirit. Oh, look at this. Look at that. <laughs> you know, there's so much love here between uh, you and this person. You know, and... I know that you 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 lay there and you lie in bed and you know you just go I know this person loves me I know they love me they have told me that they love me I can feel the love coming from them but they just won't budge like that's the worst feeling in the world. You know what I'm saying? Like, I remember, I remember lying in my bed and, and going, I know for a fact this person loves me. You know what I'm saying? It, when somebody loves you, it's, you just know, 
you just know and it, it just um you know it becomes a very puzzling thing why you know um they continue to hold themselves back right mm. okay oh so we have the king of swords right and then we have the i can't make it up you guys look at this didn't i say that they hold themselves back this your person literally stops themselves from telling you everything that they feel in their heart and everything they feel in their heart is coming from this ten of cups right look at all these cups that this person has filled up for you right this is the life that they envision that they see that they just kind of shut down right they just shut it off you know um mm. look at that and then we have the freaking four of wands come come out you guys right the four of wands is all about like marriage right a divine connection a union right it's my 11 11 card it's my twin flame card you know it, it, it it's just like um it's pure torture sometimes you know just lying in your bed lonely <laughs> you know I, I i just i can't even tell you how many times i have been in my bed and i have cried myself to sleep right and i have um just known in my heart who this person is and You know, just thought to myself, why can't we be together? Why? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Literally driving myself crazy. You know, um, mm, I remember when there were times where I would literally just do the weirdest thing, right? I would be in my room and I would be in such a depression that I, I would want to watch sad things, right? Sad music videos. Um, <laughs> but I was watching like weird stuff. Like I was watching like whales, you know what I'm saying? In the ocean, like making all kinds of noise under the water i was watching like bears it it was just a very weird time for me it was it was like i was trying to fill a void any which way i could you know because the pain was so unbearable the 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 sleepless nights was just Ooh, some that, you know, now I can just go back to and be like, wow, I really, I really used to be in that space. You know, I really used to be just down in the dumps and, and, and in that dark night of the soul. But you know what? I didn't stay there. I didn't stay there. Um, I don't know what it was that got me out of the dark night of the soul. I couldn't even tell you it was, it was just one thing. You know what I mean? It was lots of things that really had to pull me out of that place. And, um... You know, getting sleep was, was definitely uh, something that I had to start doing because I knew that it was not healthy for me. You know, I, there was one point in time where I was like, okay, 
you need to close your eyes. You need to get some rest and you need to think about your well-being. You know what I'm saying? Because I, look, I have kids. You know what I'm saying? Like it was to the point to where I was just like, oh my God, I couldn't think about nothing. You know, um, even my kids were starting to be like, okay, you know, are you okay? Or, you know, and, and I, I didn't want to do them like that. I didn't want them to feel like I was neglecting them. You know, because my person was all I could think about. I, I really had to dig deep, you guys, and and tell myself, you know, um, yeah, you may love this person, but you love your kids more. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Your kids need you. <laughs> You know, so no, I wasn't in that dark place for long, but it was starting to really, really bring me down, you guys. <clears throat> it was, you know, it's a very, it's a very dangerous place to be not getting no sleep and, and being in the dark night of the soul, you know. Okay, so we got the Ace of Swords, and then we have the Seven of Wands. It's like, it's literally like you're fighting yourself, right? You're fighting everything that is trying to push you into um, a better place. You know, when your thoughts say, okay, you need to get some sleep, you're like, okay, in a minute. <laughs> Give me some more minutes. Give me 30 more minutes. Then 30 more minutes turn into an hour. An hour turns into a few hours. And the next thing you know, you're watching the sunrise. Right? So Spirit is saying that some of you need to be honest with yourselves, okay? With this Ace of Swords out here, you need to be very clear and honest okay because I told myself that I was never going to go back there I was never going to let anyone I don't care who it is I don't care if it's my twin flame I don't care if it's my soulmate I will never let anyone take me back to that place because my life means too much to me. My kids mean too much to me. My family mean too much to me. You know, to see, um, for them to see me go through something like that. You know, so that's when I started to get my act together. You know, I really just had to sit down and, um, give myself the hard talk <laughs> you know so while you lie here and you listen to my story and and you know I'm hoping that somewhere you know um, you're finding a little relief knowing that you are not alone Okay, on this journey, you're not the only one feeling like this. And that there's always, always a way out. There's always a way out if you want it, you know. If you want this way out, you can do it. You can do it just like I did, you know. And so now I can look back and kind of laugh at the fact that I um, <laughs> I let my energy get that low, you know, but again, it was it was definitely uh, a learning lesson. Okay. It was definitely a learning lesson. you know, Spirit told me if if, if you're not getting reciprocity, 
then why spend your energy there? Right? If you're not getting equal give and take, why spend your energy there? <laughs> you know, it was like I said, I had to give myself the hard truth. Okay, so what else, Spirit? Is there anything else? Mm-hmm. Mm, yeah. <laughs> Spirit has said, yeah, somebody's definitely on their way to sleep. You know, so I am glad that I was able to come on here and express myself in a way that I haven't in a pretty long time, you know, and, and Spirit really had it on my heart to kind of um, start opening myself up to you guys. Okay. Okay. So, yeah, I really hope that I was able to comfort you in some type of way. Okay, maybe help you relax a little. You know, if I didn't help you get to sleep, if you're not asleep by now, <laughs> you know, hopefully I gave you some comfort and relaxed you to the point to where when you do click off of this video you're able to go to sleep all right so yeah i'm gonna leave this here you guys um if you liked this type of video for me okay if you like my voice a little more sultry um and a little lower we can definitely uh think about incorporating some more videos like this because i have had people asking me to bring back the asmr if y'all don't know yes i used to do asmr <laughs> and um you know i didn't think that i was very good at it so i stopped but um yeah i'm gonna leave this here all right I love you guys so, so much. It's your favorite goddess, Goddess Platinum, and I'm out.